back like we never left. It's for you with a live reaction to Amazon Reader's Viewpoint. This week, we're reading chapters 29 and 31. So let's see what's cracking. ORV, chapter 29. Wow. I'm so lucky to have a great companion, huh? Let me see Dokjo playing it up. Good to see you, Dokjo playing it up. Nigga tight. You managed to stay alive. Long story short, Jon Yuk Yu never acknowledged me as his champ as his companion. Instead, he answered by pointing his blade at Pildu Gong. <laughs> he didn't even answer, bro. <laughs> Pildu, Pildu Gong didn't seem to want any bloodshed, so he let us go for the time being. Did you want me to die? I didn't really care that much. Companion my ass. Ha <laughs> ha! Dog job! I would, love to so I would love to sock his jaw right now, but his stats are probably no joke right now. What are you looking at? Personal skill. Character profile activated. There is too much information about this character. Converting character profile into a character summary. Oh, shit. Activate full version. I didn't see it when I read the novel, but... Damn. Opening full version of... Of Jung Yuk Yu's character profile. Age 28. The, a regret, the Regressor, third round, mythical, pro gamer, rare. Level eights, level eights in Odyssey Sage, combat, weapon proficiency, mental barrier, like he got everything. The list of skills have been abridged. Like bro, he got skills in everything, bro. 24 stamina, strength, agility, like bro, he is crazy. Now I see how extraordinary, how extraordinary he is. Damn protagonist. He may even be stronger. He may even be stronger than him. He may even be stronger than he was during his third round in the novel. Did he have something else he wanted to say? That means he's taking more risks. What is he scheming when this is only his third round? I'm asking if you had something you wanted to tell me. No, I was admiring that ugly mug of yours. He is determined to... He is, he is as determined as I am to be, to remember him to be. Determined my ass, that emo bastard. But he's starting to get on my nerves. Should I kill him? I'm joking. Turn that frown upside down, friend. Prisoner of the Golden Headband is disappointed in you. Okay, bruh. Okay. Okay, we see our whole all homies Hyun saying, "Ah, uh, Mr. Lee Gil Young, all the homies chilling." You must have made new companions. Jung Yuk is a little disappointed in you. What? Why? Jung Yuk Jung Yuk has activated the skill Eye of the Sage. I left Hyun Sung with him, but how? Look how weak he is. How disappointing. Hyun Sung Lee. Would have been even stronger if he had accompanied Jung. Mm, yeah, true, true, true. If he had accompanied Jung Yuk, he would have been way stronger. But still, I'm just an ordinary reader who is lucky enough to know the future. What is it? How has he? Huh? Who? Who is he looking at? They're standing together, so it's difficult, difficult to tell. Is he looking at Hui Wan? Yeah, he has to be, bro. He's like, yo, how did he get her on the squad? You know what I'm saying? I want to ask him, but then he'll find out that I'm reading his thoughts. What the hell are you looking at? Good. Well done. Well done, Kui Wan. Should I kill... Jung Yuk Yu? I wanted to ask you something. Why are you leaving Pildu Gong alone? Crazy bastard. If you were a real prophet, you'd know. Prophets don't know everything, you know. Jun Yu activated a lie detection skill. Jun Yu is using a lie detection. He's trying to see if he's damn. He's so damn meticulous. Well, I guess you're right. 
the level of your future vision skill must not be that that's not be high enough think whatever you'd like <laughs> dope just like bro think whatever you want bro i need Pildugong alive for the upcoming scenario right i know that i need him for a future scenario but you only need Pildugong, not his entire gang I thought it was more your style to keep things simple. Why are you letting them run rampant? Mmm. How annoying. What? I am a busy man. You'll never understand. Wait! This is, isn't something you can just easily ignore. Just ignore so easily. If you don't do something, the people in Chung Moreau will... It doesn't concern me. He just, can I punch you just this once? He clenches his fist, Dokja. Do you really have the confidence to? Let me see. That man activated Tiger God Aura. Jung Yu, the damn, about to fucking fight. Oh, Lord. That bastard. Let's go. And we see Jung Yu and an old girl dip off. One hour and 30 minutes remain until the third scenario was activated. Third scenario will last exactly one week. Jun Yuk Yu is probably planning to get something he wants during this time. Okay, the peasant's army is angered by people suffering of the common people. It's calling for the people revolution. Facts. Talk about it. I can't leave. I can't let him have his way. I can't, but. The constellation prisoner of the golden headband is wondering what you're thinking. Jung Yuk Yu, that son of a bitch, is pleased. <laughs> golden headband is pleased. He gives him a hundred coins. You were scared a little, weren't you? Sorry. When you were talking to that Jung Yuk guy, <laughs> as if Yuk just says. But, but, but more importantly. I'm worried about what to do with the Pildugong, Gong and his gang. I didn't change the subject because I was scared. Pildugong is more of a problem right now than Jun Yuk Yu. From, where, from what I heard, they claim ownership over public spaces and they ask people for rent, those greedy bastards. In order to complete the third scenario, we need Pildugong's help. But if he won't help us, I'll kick his ass. That won't work. I should get them better weapons. <laughs> Yo, don't you? We can beat them if we join forces. Remember Gengho Station? Damn, and we say Hu Hui Wan Zhang activated the skill. Time of judgment. The scales. Bring. The constellations of the pure good alignment remain silent upon Hui Wee Jung's effect. The skill has been cancelled. Huh? What's this? Is it broken? Hmm. Time of judgment is a personal skill that belongs to the judge of evil. Is an all-powerful buff skill that is ridiculously overpowered. But the catch is... It only works on the intended target if the intended target is an evildoer. Why isn't the skill activating? Pildu Gong and his gang are definitely evil. That's only from our perspective. What are you? I'm saying that the standards of morality that we humans abide by may be different from that of the constellations. Justice, in most cases, it's just something that is agreed upon by the majority. Yeah. Yo, mate, what's up, bro? How you doing, brother? Um, this is still hold up. Twenty nine still. I'm at the the like end of twenty nine. How how can that? But there may be a way. Sorry, it won't be easy, but there might be a way we can defeat them. What is it? We have to lure Pildu Gong out of his militarized zone. Let me see. <laughs> see, Pildu. Hey, 
His, his stigma, materialized zone, is an optimal defense skill. But it only works in specific areas that he has designed. His turrets will be useless if he leaves his area of effect. But it won't be easy to lure him out. He has blankets, food, and even a chamber pot. He's practically staging a sit-in. What's so special about that place? It's the biggest room in Chung Miro. Room. One hour. Until one hour remaining until the third scenario is activated. Sh shit! Don't come near me! You'll see the guy in the room. Let's worry about Pildu Gong before later. We should start looking for a room. Well, well, let's begin the third scenario. The third day of the main scenario, shall we? I see some new faces here today. Aren't you all excited? Let's see, Doki Lee pulls up, snaps the fingers. Bring, 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 bring. The screen's following their faces. Main scenario, green zone, day three. Difficulty C. Occupy a green zone in the station and survive the monsters that emerge each night at midnight. The scenario will last for seven days. Duration, eight hours. Reward, a thousand coins. Okay. All right, bro. We see it. Stage is set. Let's see what's going on here now. Stage is set, bro. Bruh. All right, I need you to go to the next chapter, please. I need you to go to the next chapter, please. Flame scans. I need you to go to the next chapter. If he started at day three, couldn't he have st stayed at the previous station for four days and not have to do anything? It's possible. I don't know, to be honest. One hour remaining. This is... The rules are simple. Occupy a green zone before any anyone else. You can el you can also steal someone else's green zone, of course. You better hurry. If you can't find your own green zone by midnight, you'll be in deep trouble. Well, good luck then. Let me see Doki B dips off. Die already! Let me see. Oh my god, everyone's just killing people for these zones, bruh. It's nothing personal. I just don't want to die. You see, stabbed. Down bad, bro. Horrendous. Do you really think we'll have to fight like that? There, will, there won't be a need. There won't be a need to. We need to find the room that could hold all of us. Green zones vary in size. Some houses only one person. While others, like the one Pildu Gong is occupying, can hold up to 70 people. Let's split up and find the room. Hyunseng, Seng Ah can team up, and Hui Wan and Gil Young can go together. What about you, Dokja? I'll go on my own. If none of us find the room in 20 minutes before the scenario starts, let's meet back here. Everyone nods. They split off. They probably. This is like thought. Damn. Won't be any. Oh my god. This is like thought. Won't be able to find us a room. There are no rooms left in Chung Moro. You see on his fucking phone. Oh my god. Oh my god. That leaves only one option. But could they really take innocent lives? For the sake of saving ourselves, 30 minutes remain in the sec third scenario. Dokja, Do sitting there, scrolling, trying to figure it out. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Oh, 
Constellation, prisoner of the golden headband, is wondering what you're up to. Come to think of it, it won't do me any good to let B. Young or other constellations know that I am a reader of TWSA. What are you doing? What are you? What are you doing? Staring at your into a blank screen. You're you're boring the constellations to death. Blank screen. A blank screen. You mean this? Oh, so as he's reading it, they can't even see what it is. It's got privacy blocker on the screen, bro. That's lit. Hold on. Yes. Are you brainstorming or something? You'll die if you just sit here like that. What did I ever see in you? So the constellations and Dokibi, who have the highest administrative power, must not be able to see anything on my screen. If they could, they would have brought it up much earlier. Then how powerful is the author who sent me this supposed to be? Yup, that's the big dog. That's big dog, bro. The author? Hold on, big dog. Ah! See, crack. See a zone of one person. <sighs> Don't come any closer. Don't worry. I won't steal your spot. Really? You seem quite laid back, old man. Maybe you don't want to live anymore. This rude bastard could only could only be. You seem laid back as I am. Man, she grins. That's crazy. No one will dare come near my room. They know very well what's going to happen to them if they do. She puts things with sword around. Well. They own the only people who could fight against Ji Hei here would be the with Landlord Coalition and Jung Yuk Yu. But I don't want I don't want you to die. I was impressed by how you stood up to the master. I won't. Don't you worry. And you don't necessarily have to find a room to survive the night. Are you that strong? As strong as master? You should return to the room. Oh, master. Yes, sir. Are you going to fight the monsters? You'll die. And your buddies, too. Doctor shrugs. Well, we'll have to see about that. jong Yu looks on. Just turns and leaves. What? That's ridiculous. Two thousand coins per night? Are they kidding? We ought to split their heads open. Dokja. We couldn't find the room. Dokja, do you know what they told us upstairs? They asked for ridiculously high rent, right? You knew? Did you find anything, Dokja? Nope, nothing. We have two options. That many? <laughs> the first option in which we all live is easier than the two. When that's the case, when that's the case, people usually end up going with the second option. What's the other option? The second option will be arduous. And one of us could end up dying. And you see, everyone looks on. It's chapter 30 of ORV. Chapter 30. Let's go, Vic. If there's a chance for all of us to survive, we should go with the first option then. Let's go with the first one, Nod. Can you tell us what they what they are first? The first is over there. Yeah. The room occupying a how the room occupying can house five people. But their stats aren't very high. Just a few of us will be enough to wait, Dokcha, are you? Yes. The first option is to kill them and take their room. Yeah, they don't understand that, bro. I like how three of them are, are all stunned, right? But young Gil is like, don't look stunned, bro, because he probably figured that. It's, I'm up for it. You see, I'm up for it as long as you're willing to do it. Like, that man, young Gil, ready. Ready. Oh, I'm not scared. I'll do it. No, Gil Young. Don't you think we already thought of that? They probably killed others to occupy that room as well. If we carry on like this, we won't be able to compete complete future scenarios. Dokja. 
I killed someone in Gyungho Station. I did so out of my own volition, and I don't regret it one bit, but just because I killed someone doesn't mean that I enjoy doing it. I don't want to become a monster. You see, she looking at Dokja. Dokja looking back at her. Dokja, I want to hear what the second option is. Hmm, I understand. We'll go with the second option. Ha, huh, I knew it. Why test us like that? And she's slapping him. Why test us? I was trying to test you. That hurts. I would have respected your choice. No matter which path you chose. And we see he ruffles Gil Young's hair. Now that we all agreed on the second option, you'll have to do exactly what I tell you. Please trust me, no matter how ridiculous I sound. If you fail to do that, we will all die. Five minutes remaining until the third scenario begins. Lumin got more heart. I'm telling you, bro, he, he, he's got more heart, bro. He's different. Monsters are likely to spawn from that direction. They will rampage through the station and make their way to the ground floor. Then we fight them all. Then do we fight them off from here? No, we can't. If we do, we'll all die. We need to split up for this plan to work. Hyun Seong, Sung Ah, and Hui Wan. Yeah, one team. If you have, you have to trust me 100%. The third main scenario activated. When monsters spawn, I want you to run towards them. Now! And we see, they run right toward, they run right towards them. Ha, ha. <sighs> Yo, what the fuck? And then we see Gil, young Gil on Doctor's back. On Doctor's back. Oh shit! How's it gonna go, bro? Nah, Doctor said, "Yo, when they spawn, run toward them." That's crazy. That's crazy, bro. Run towards the monster. Run towards the direction of the monsters. Not towards the, the not towards the entrance of Dong Daegu? Yes. You have to run towards the front. And no matter what happens, you have to run even if monsters spawn. Just before you reach them, look towards the left wall. Oh shit. Okay, so so main scenario starts. Boom. Monster spawn. Boom. We see R3. Sang Ah. Mr. Lee, Hui Wan, dip off, start running. Left wall, they look. Ah! You see a boom, a little green zone. A little green zone. Oh shit. So we see as they're running, saying, ah, sees the little green mark. Goes to touch at it. Monster, ah, claws. Someone has activated a hidden feature of Chengmuro Station, and we see them. Boom, hidden space, green zone for the brave. Oh shit. And we see, boom, one of them, they activate a green zone, they always touch it. Huh? Oh shit. Oh, we see Mr. Lee gets, Mr. Lee gets stopped though, by a bear. We see Sang Ah with like some kind of like with I think from her like her like one of her one of her skills like a, a like the, the the rope or the tether or whatever. She tied it to Mr. Lee and yanks the boy back. Yeah, get over here, you boy. <laughs> get over here, boy. <laughs> In the third main scenario, there are several hidden green zones. Green zone three of three. Dokja. It is activated on a specific on a specific wall every time and every time and can only be seen once the scenario has been at, has begun. Those green zones are attached to a wall. Come think of it, humans were the one, were the only ones who took this concept as a 
to the concept as a room in the first place. You know, see Dokja just running, running with the monsters, the bears, giant turtle animals, giant fucking rhinos and shit. Crazy. Yo, Dokja running away. Boom. Dokja fighting. Fighting away. There are only two green zones hidden in Platform Line 3. I'm sure the second one's somewhere around here. And oh my god, we see one guy's there. And it's a one of it's a one of one, two. Oh no. It's a one of one. Shit. I honestly just want to take his take over his place. <laughs> Things have turned out quite amusing. <clears throat> Don't you think that you should pay? There should be some penalty, right? And the fucking Dokibi pulls up. Scenario penalty has been added. Oh my god. A few of the existing green zones will be disabled, huh? And we see the one of one green zone this rando guy was in evaporates, bro, right into the air. No! Ah! Boom! Dead instantly. Ah, please help! Ah, oh my god. Whoa. To keep on fighting these mods till sunrise. Yo. John Kyuk sure is a monster. See, boom! Even if I invest all my coins into stats, would it be possible for me as well? Honestly, I, I, I won't be confident. Hyung, I'm busy, so hurry it up. You can leave me here. Huh? What? I don't get it. Why are you helping me and the others? If I were you, if if you were alone, you could survive on your own. Uh, ching. Honestly, I also don't know why I'm going this far. Dang, Gil, yo, yo, Gil, yo, crazy, bro. Yo, he's like, yo, brother, why, yo, young, big bro, why are you even here, bro? If I was you, I know you could survive on your own, bro. If I was you, I would dip off by myself, dolo. Nah, that's crazy. Crazy. <laughs> yo, are those who all right? I can't see them, but I'm sure of one thing. Yes, you're right. <laughs> and when you talk to just cut everything up, boy. Slice everything up, boy. One time. I can eat on my own and survive on my own. It's much easier to live on my own. But I know a novel that had a plot based on that, and the plot was ruined. He picks, he picks up Gil Young. I'm not the main character. I also can't be the hero or the savior, but I cannot let Lee Gil Young die. Let's see. Bring. Screen power in front of them. At least for today. Hold on tight. Pops that John. List of book characters on the bookmark. Let's go. Shit, man. Kim Nam Woon. Lee Hyung Sun. Jeon and Ho. Dang, bruh. Bookmark 1 has been enabled. Dip off. Yo, the fucking bookmark ability is so fire, bruh. Do you see Dokja, Gil Young fighting on. There it is! You see the green light through the monsters. Just a little further. They, they're running through. Jumping on. Damn. Dokja jumps in the air. One Gil Young in one hand. Sword in the other, bro. Into the air. Hat. Huh? Huh? Oh my god, bro. There's no way. There's no way he's here. <laughs> bro, we see as Doctor jumps in the air, right? With Gleung, right? He he sees who's huh? He sees who we see standing in front of the green zone. John Yuk, bro. Jung Yuk, novel MC, this absolute asshole, bro. Just standing in front of it. A dick. Damn it. Hey. 
Can't you go somewhere else? You don't need... You don't even need a green zone to survive. I'm in danger because I'm tired. That's me outside the exam hall. That's crazy. Bruh, crazy. Is mad that MC used his name when... Right, yeah, oh, interesting. He's, he's mad he name dropped him, bruh. That's so bullshit, bro. I'm in danger because I'm tired. Damn it. How does Jung-Yuk of the third regression know this place? I really want to punch him so hard. I thought I was the only one who knew how to use, who knew to use a hidden green zone because nobody had discovered it. Kit. He looks at him. Take the child. Give the child. Oh. Okay. Hold on. Wait, what? So, so Marvel MC goes tells to give him Gil Young, and Dolce goes to t tell him to take him. He hoped that MC would have died and wouldn't he keep his end of the deal when dropped off the bridge. Right, exactly for sure. Third green zone, two of two. Hey, hold on, Young! We'll see. Constellation. Ball General of Justice closes his eyes. The constant demon like Justice of Fire is watching you with uncomfortable eyes. He just fights on, bro. He just fights, Dokja. Jesus. I told you, you would die. This nigga, bro. And Dokja looks back at this guy, bro. Jung Yuk, a sick freak. As he looks on, I'm not going to die. Dokja says, I'm not going to die. <laughs> oh my gosh. And we just see all these monsters just collapse. Boom. Right on the Dokja, bro. Young! Oh my gosh. Occupy a green zone in the station and survive the waves of monsters. Scenario will last for seven days. To be continued. Bruh. ORV. Chapter 31. End. Oh my god, bro. Oh my god, dude. Don't you know? Bruh. This guy is such a snake, bro. Novel MC is such a snake, bro. It's crazy. Him pulling up and being like, yo, I don't fuck with you, bruh. So I'm just gonna blatantly fuck you over. Crazy. How does our boy survive this, bro? How does he survive this, bruh? Crazy. Absolutely crazy, bro. This man, Jung Yook make me sick, bro. I can't stand him, bro. I can't wait till a day, hopefully, where Dokja can just, like, bro, just, mm, just punch him right in his face, bro. I'm sick of him, bro. Sick of him. Crazy, bro. Absolutely crazy. Absolutely crazy, bro. Maybe he doesn't, and we get a new MC, bro. Yo, what? Stop, that'd be crazy. Nah, I like Dokja, bro. Don't say that. I fuck with Dokja. He's real. He's real. Man, you're crazy. But we made it to the end of the live reaction. I appreciate so much. If you enjoyed, don't forget, drop a like on the video. It really helped the boy out. Also, subscribe to the channel. We're bringing different live reactions weekly, and we're on Doors 1K. So I'm going to see y'all next time. Stay safe out in these streets. And I'm going to see y'all soon. Peace.